Such good buys. Such good buys. Okay. Go they on. gave me the wrong one. This is the problem. I haven't washed off my tan yet. Anyways, today's video is going to be a haul. I spent a ridiculous amount of money. Normally, I just kind of get like one or two things off ASOS that I know one is going to go back. So I just get a refund. But I did go mad. Because you know, whenever you get like money or whatever from like a relative, I basically pre-spent the money that they're hopefully going to give me for presents. That's going to be really embarrassing to end. This, well, you'll see it in my beauty debate order. My tan is slightly questionable. I should really put my hands down. So I'm going to do a try on all because I was like, why the fuck not? Like I'm wearing tan. That's the only reason why I'm doing a try on haul. I'm wearing tan. So therefore I feel so skinny. Okay. I think I'm going to start off from beauty base. So the, oh yeah. So I got stuff from three places. I got monkey, which is like the biggest chunk of stuff. And then like Ragged Priest, I got one pair of jeans and then Beauty Bay, I got um, a little box. Don't get me started on Beauty Bay, don't get me started. I was get I my whole purpose was to get a bronzer because like I'm literally running out of my hula and I was kind of like, I don't want to spend 30 on a bronzer more and I also want to really try a shimmery bronzer. So I was like, okay, Grant, I'll get a matte bronzer and a shimmery bronzer that are like both kind of cheapish so that I could, you know, test them both out. I get this package and I'm so excited. It also comes late, even though I paid for express delivery, even though I spent actually 75 euro for express delivery. It comes late. I open the box and then I see this like gold box I'm like oh my god this is my bronzer like I'm so excited like the whole purpose of the order was the bronzer and then I take it out and then I couldn't get it open like the sticker was on things so then I was like fuck it so I just started ripping it because I was like I'm not returning it so I got a shimmery bronzer and a matte bronzer can't even open this can you get me a little knife just rip the box can't I just I'm keeping it like I better be keeping it in this is so difficult <laughs> I can't open it. I could have done that. And I was too. I shouldn't have fucking ripped it. They or... gave me the wrong one. Illuminating. Is that the one you got? No, I didn't get illuminating. Oh, I shouldn't have fucking ripped it. <laughs> I was like, it's not coming back. Moral of the story: just open everything nicely. I got the MUA lip. MUA lip liner, intense colour in TLC and it's such a nice nude like it's I'll swatch it my hand anyways because I've already ruined my hand but it is so nice and it's so soft and it was literally two euro because I always end up like losing lip liner or something so like why would I spend so much money on it and what I'm wearing that's that and soft matte lip cream in Abu Dhabi so nice it's so fucking comfortable on the lips as well stunning this is my first time buying makeup online but anyways but they matched literally perfectly I didn't even plan that this is all over TikTok and it's basically like a lip gloss that doesn't transfer. I would show you on my hand, but that is fucking what happened last time. But I might as well just go on top of it. So I see it comes with like a pigment and then like a weird like glossy seal. You know, it's in the shade Global Citizen. I think you wait for this to dry or something. I don't know. It really should have come with instructions because I was very confused. But that's it there. Then I got this little angled brush because for my winged eyeliner, I've been using my Morphe one that I got ages ago. Morphe M432. But it's like really big. This is literally, it's from, yeah, Beauty Bay is like proper, like their own brand. Then my shimmery bronzer, which I have on today. I don't think you can actually see it. The bronzer is looking very questionable today. Like from front on, it's fine. So I got the Milani number no. 5 Soleil. This was literally all over YouTube and stuff in like 2014. Ordinary full coverage foundation in wool in 21y i think that would have been a good match for me today but it was downstairs and i was too lazy to go get it it was literally only six euro or something mad so yeah i'm really happy with that i love smashbox primerizer i've repurchased it three times it's literally 35 euro i do not want to spend that much money sorry on a primary like it does do wonders so i looked up dupes and this one came up and it was only five like five or six euros so i was like might as well try it ordinary high spreadability fluid primer next thing i got which was the yeah, thing that they got wrong <sighs> i literally destroyed the box i'm not that kind of gal but anyways this is the dripping gold illuminating bronzer and i just wanted the normal matte bronzer but they gave me the illuminating one so hopefully they'll be understanding enough to give me a new one so now we've got to close we'll set up a monkey just wanted like summer vibes and then i fucking love monkey jeans they're the only jeans i wear like black jeans i have dark blue jeans i have light blue jeans i had and then i got a new pair but they don't fit me but i got i got so nice like they're so like soft and i'm not sure what these ones are i always normally just get the tacky 
the tacky ones they are so nice and they're such a nice color they really look for really light denim and they're just like straight legs um amy had a pair of these and they were the kimono ones but she like i don't know went hard and set or something and they were ruined so i just got a new pair because i really wanted a light pair of jeans try that on for you now and i'll actually just do an outfit vibe then i got this because i had this zara top and it's like the ones that are like they were all in yet last summer and they like scrooched at the front they make me look like less like a square because i shaped like a door so having a bit of v vibes is kind of good even though amy's like mm, phoebe you're trying to look like an hourglass when you're a square I'm like but i know i'm a square like i'm not trying to hide it i'm just trying to okay hi sorry i didn't really say sizing in this video it's really weird i said it in passing and i couldn't understand it myself so i thought i'd do a little clip of me running you through all the sizes so basically the acid wash rip jeans and the ecru jeans are in a 33 and the normal jeans and the ragged priest jeans are in a 32 all the tops are in a medium if you want to buy ragged priest jeans i'd recommend sizing up because they don't have that much gift to them they're very kind of rigid and denimy um and the monkey jeans kind of true to size or you could size down if you want to because they do they're kind of like in between sizes like the 29s 31s 33s um because they kind of give as you wash and wear them not a lot though but like you know just personal preference i suppose um yeah i do have monkey jeans in a 30 that fit me but i got these in a 33 and 32 because i wanted them to be like quite oversized and big which they kind of fit me which is a bit of a problem but we're not gonna talk about it um yeah any questions comment down below and i'll get back to you about anything i think that's it so enjoy the video so yeah this is um outfit number one i'm not wearing bra this which i probably should be wearing bra with it but like I absolutely love the jeans. Maybe I find them a bit so you can actually see them. No, absolutely love the jeans. Love them. <laughs> this is like great angles for me, isn't it? Really good. Okay, I'm just gonna stay standing rather than sitting down and moving this again. I'm gonna do them in outfits. So I got a pair of like um ecru, like creamy jeans. These are them. Um, I'll try these on, and then I got these two little tops, which I love. Amy hates, but what to do so i got these ones i just thought they'd be really nice if i was just wearing like these jeans or whatever um with this because they're like very chill um and they're just like really cropped this kind of looks like a nursing outfit but we're not going to talk about it yeah these are only literally like a tanning as well gorge i got the same one in black i don't really have that much black so i thought might as well get like a few staples in black and i got this i'll try that on with the ecru jeans I popped on a necklace because i felt very bare I know this is kind of freaking me out. Didn't try and help, but very cropped. Like if I raise my, yeah, like very cropped. Again, not wearing a bra, but like I don't really wear a bra half the time these days. I really like them. I think. Um, I haven't really had like a proper analyze of them. I feel like I might watch this back and then be like, they need to go. But that's what we're working with. Why does my neck not match my chest? This is slightly awkward. There's nothing worse than getting a pair of jeans that fit perfectly here. But are like tight here. Do you know what I mean? So it's I feel like it's just best to size up because a belt is always the go better than like being accidental flares. Like we don't want that here. Yeah, so jeans I think are keep and the tops I definitely keep because like just love them. I just really like them. Yeah, vibe. I can't see that far. Don't my glasses in, but I think they're a vibe. The next thing I have are ripped jeans. So these are the kind of ones that I'm slightly iffy about I'm not sure if i like them or not they're like just a really faint acid wash and they've got rips but they've got frays in them again i don't know if this is the kind of thing that amy's brainwashed me into hating or else i actually just hate by myself but we'll see and then i really want one of these cardigan thingies with the ties i just think another excuse not to wear a bra these are these jeans i don't know this is for future phoebe to figure out if she actually likes these jeans or not I do think me editing this, I will hate all these clothes, but I do try and help the peeps, you know? I also get these scrunchies. Can pack three, I have the pink one in. That's what they look like in. Can you even see that? I do not know. But anyways, so that is everything from Monkey that I got. The last place I went to, what I went to, I clicked onto was Ragged Priest. Freaking love the Ragged Priest. And I love the black and lime squiggly jeans. So nice. Um, but they're out of stock like all the time and then got an email at like 1am and they really got me. I think they scheduled that email at 1am just to like people being like sleep deprived and being like oh, I need these. 
which was me, was quite a concept for one pair of jeans, including shipping and everything. Uh, but it's worth it. To be fair, I was looking at my wardrobe being like, I am lacking a green and black squiggly pair of jeans, you know? So I'm just going to show you the jeans in here because they just look so much better. You literally can't tell me any different. They also come in white and green, but the black and green is just more of a vibe, isn't it? I tried it on with the little crappy top thingy, but it just wasn't working. Stunning. Like, they're just so pretty. And this is the cardigan. It's just really nice. It just has two little um, stringy thingies, and it's just a plain black cardigan. But anyways, such good bodies, such good vibes. Okay. Well done, Phoebe. Well, well done, Phoebe. Um, we're not going to talk about makeup in this whole video because I just realised that in some lights it literally just looks like a mask. Just everything from my haul. It was a big one. She was a big one, but she was a big one, but she was needed. Do you know what I mean? An absolute no regrets. I don't think I'll bring back anything, to be honest. I really don't. I think I love everything here. Well, it's not my makeup because it's very questionable, but it's fine. It's fine. It was money well spent, I think. And also, actually, while we're here, might as well talk about something so i ordered three pairs of jeans four tops and a pack of scrunchies from monkey which if i ordered the exact same from asos everything would have come in separate like singular bags but when i tell you okay let me show you it literally just came in this big box and everything was just folded folded in the box there was no bit of plastic inside and then i just got this a, like a receipt of like everything I ordered and then a little returns label if I wanted to return it Literally not one bit of plastic and monkey jeans are all a bunch of organic cotton and stuff. So just Oh, just love monkey. I ordered it on a Friday and it came yesterday. So it came in less than a week Which is so good and ragged priest came really really soon as well I think I ordered that on a Sunday and it came is my first pa package that came as well Everything came yesterday. That is the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed. Bye.